National Disability Institute and Hands-On Banking welcomes you to our 10-minute training series. This training is on using a financial health assessment, one of four short videos in our series funded by a grant from the Wells Fargo Foundation. This session will offer you a quick glimpse at how you can use a financial health assessment to better understand and support participants' progress towards financial capability and enhance programmatic outcomes at your organization or agency. You may be new to the concept of a financial health assessment. If that's so, you're in the right place. In this training, you will learn the answer to the question, what is a financial health assessment? You will learn about the benefits of using a financial health assessment, including how a financial health assessment can assist customers to improve financial well-being and employment goals. You'll see an example of a financial health assessment tool, and you will discover other hands-on banking resources available to increase your understanding about financial empowerment. Let's get started. What is a financial health assessment? A financial health assessment is a tool that includes a variety of financial questions. It has two roles, the first for the customer and second for you, the service professional. For the customer, a financial health assessment provides the opportunity to assess their current financial health. We may often feel the pressure of our personal finances, but we may not be sitting down to assess how our financial well-being is impacting our life. By answering these key questions, a customer can begin to think about the pathways they can take to improve their financial circumstances and celebrate where they have been successful. For employment specialists, case managers, and other service professionals, a financial health assessment is a tool to better understand a customer's current situation and provide opportunities to guide them in addressing their financial needs. This tool can help guide job seekers to resources and assistance that can stabilize their employment situation and empower them as they move forward. Just like going to the dentist or doctor for regular checkups is important, everyone should examine their financial health. Therefore, financial health assessments are a benefit to any customer and can be used with customers both with and without a disability. There are multiple benefits of using the financial health assessment. It assists in identifying barriers to employment, as well as goals that motivate a customer to work. It provides an opportunity to identify community resources that a customer may be able to use. It creates a way to start the conversation with the customer on their financial struggles and goals. It provides the customer with both the awareness of their current situation and an opportunity to work on items that they may have not thought of before, all to assist them in achieving financial capability. And finally, the assessment builds our personal financial capability and our knowledge of financial capability strategies. There are many times when it may be beneficial to incorporate a financial health assessment into your programs and services. Some of these times include the initial intake process, the pre-employment questionnaire, during or at the end of an employment training program, prior to a financial education class or as part of a financial education class, or as part of the benefits counseling process. You may also find it is helpful for a customer to retake a financial health assessment throughout their time in the program, as a customer's financial well-being, goals, and motivations can shift over time. It is also a good opportunity for you, the service professional, to assess the customer's progress with meeting their financial and employment goals. Now you may be ready to integrate a financial health assessment into your program, but where do you find one? National Disability Institute has created a 25 question financial health assessment to help gather information about a customer's current financial situation. Remember, there are no right or wrong answers 
and be sure to share a copy of the completed assessment with your customer. National Disability Institute's Financial Health Assessment can be found at https colon forward slash forward slash bit dot ly forward slash 2RBBU7L. It can also be found linked in the description for this training on the NDI website at www.realeconomicimpact.org. Now that you know more about financial health assessments, you may want to learn more about other resources that support a customer's financial well-being. National Disability Institute has released quick reference and disability supplemental guides that complement the hands-on banking instructor guides for adults, young adults, and entrepreneurs. These guides are designed to provide financial educators, American job centers, vocational rehabilitation, and community-based organizations access to resources and tools specifically for customers with disabilities. You can find these ready-to-use financial education materials and tools at www.realeconomicimpact.org forward slash financial dash education forward slash disability dash reference dash guides. So now what? Take action. But first, congratulate yourself on taking the first step towards assisting your customers to improve their pathway to financial stability by learning more about how you can integrate financial education into your programs and services. After you watch this video, take a few minutes to visit www.realeconomicimpact.org and download the materials we discussed today. Then, you're ready to create a plan to integrate financial education unique to your programs and services. Once you have a plan, put it into action and begin assisting customers to build a better economic future for themselves and their families. And finally, if you need help, reach out. We are here to help you. Email us at info at ndi-inc. Dot org. Thank you. Please explore the additional videos on consumer engagement, resource mapping, and the integration of financial education within American job centers and community-based organizations. We thank you for your participation. These materials were supported by a grant from the Wells Fargo Foundation.